state of emergency in New York. A deluge of two months worth of rain falling on the city in 24 hours. Hey, one last right. 100 meters, 22 to 24, and a fast 360. Been a very slow 400 yards. Oh, yeah, baby. Let's go. Off. My coach on my team put this down as an aggressive workout. So far, I've been faster on every time. Subscribe to me. Maybe you can just love the rain. I didn't miss the time the whole time, so I was like, not fucking happening on the last one. <laughs> Those puddles got so big in the end. I was like, it was like resistance when I was like, you know, my shoes are so waterlogged. You're a trooper for that. It's like 6 a.m. We have a release today, so we have to run early, but we have 12 miles, so you kind of have to like block out a good amount of time to get the run in so that you can get to the warehouse and still get everything ready. So we'll just bang this out and it'll be good. Other than that, we feel good? Yeah. I wouldn't, I wouldn't say so. This run's just so boring. I hate this run. It's just boring. I didn't eat beforehand, so I'm just thinking about food. It's like, I just feel like it's one of those runs where, since it's like slow and controlled, and it's early, my body never fully like wakes up. Yeah. Because I didn't warm up properly. You get to the third lap of the park, and this section just kills. I've yet to do three. I think you should, bro. Because it was 880 elevation for me. I, I think I was like seven, 770. So, I mean, New York's like 900 something. I think it's 800. And we still had six miles to go. Yeah. So we would have hit there regardless, probably. Anytime it gets hard on a hill, Post 16, I'm like, uh -huh. this shit is literally what I need. Yeah. It's a mental battle of like, this is how it's gonna feel during the marathon. Sun's coming up. Well, that means the middle of the week is over officially halfway over. over. Yeah. That one's a doozy. Actually, though, now the real day starts. Not a ton of uh, not a ton of stuff, so it's not as crazy as some have been. But still, you want it to go smooth. Go, go. Hello. How are you? For the pop-up, we got a bunch of the linen pants, but we need to get them dry cleaned, so this guy's meeting us. This like dry cleaner is picking up all the, all the pieces. Seven minutes. Seven minutes. Since this release is much smaller, like, it's gonna sound so stupid, but like, 
you become like numb to it for the most part. It's still crazy to think about, you know, all the people, but I don't know if my mic's picking up my vibrating. Yeah, my, do you hear this? These are all orders. It's like the in. orders coming in. Yeah, every time my phone vibrates, like it's a new order, like 75 orders just came rolling in. You can just see the shop effect. Like, do, 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 do. I think we're sold out of a black already, to be honest. You heard the man. 10 greens left, zero blacks. R.I.P. <laughs> and you're gonna pack all of those orders sitting in that. We're gonna try. We're gonna try, yeah. It we'll might see. not be possible. It's a good amount. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Welcome to the show. Before I had any business, Sean and I were both working our respective jobs. It would be like 6 a.m. on a Saturday. I would go into Sean's room. <laughs> Sean would just be waking up or something. I would have been up for a couple hours because I like do my best work in the morning and I would immediately hit him with like eight business ideas that I had come to me like over the course of last night and this morning and I'd be like this is how we're gonna do it and like all this stuff and it got to the point where he just started ignoring me because it would be as soon as he opened his eyeballs in the morning I would just be like all right this is a business all right so it's drop day December 16th about 7 a.m. We've been up since 4.30, trying to get everything prepped. The biggest thing that I don't have ready yet is the website itself. Uh, all the clothes and stuff are prepped. We probably don't have enough boxes made. And so we'll, we'll keep working through that. Back in college, when I, when I liked certain things, I would like say it was mint. I'd be like, oh, it's pretty mint. And then one day it was kind of just needed a name for the brand because I knew I was starting it. This was like probably around December 27th, but I wanted to start a brand like January 1 of 2021 and see how far I could take it in one year. The goal going in was could I grow it to $100,000 a year in revenue and then could I also get it to the point where I could quit my job. That was kind of like if you think short-term larger goals that was the overarching theme and then obviously you just take it day by day and month by month and kind of just grow it and then it just exploded and like everything took off way faster than got the truck 10 inch a 10 inch box truck because if we went any bigger we wouldn't be able to use certain tunnels. So hopefully we can fit everything into this box truck here and we're chilling. Well, we have space now. About 4,000 square feet of it. We'll have an assembly line from there all the way through. And I, yeah, for a first warehouse, I guess it's as good as it can get. <laughs> thousand days in, thousand in like three days in, I think. So, trying to stay afloat. Like, there's some days where, like, Mark's and I get so bogged down with, like, everyday work that, like, we don't really, like, meet up and, like, talk not even like next steps, but just like how shit's going. And those are the weeks that can weigh down on you because you're like, you never take a step back and are like, okay, like how are we progressing? It's just like every day is just like a like scramble mode. So like learning how to like talk better and like communicate better about like the direction and like check-in and stuff like that, I think it's helpful for us. But it's hard, I think like, 70% of business fa businesses fail within the first 10 years, I think. And like 10 years is a long time. So it's not easy. It's not easy. Kind of with the 
Let me check. Yeah, because we combined them.